dhe shumë shka që ka të bëjmë me rajonin e që a i e prek dhe një nga avër, në besër jens, thank you for being with us in this special show called Politikov. Thank you for having me. Yeah, we are in Pristina Mall, how do you see the, the investment since uh, I, I understood that uh, you were part of the inauguration and, uh, and also you know the chairman? Yes, yes, that's true. And uh, I must say, I do feel uh, a bit of ownership myself to this project. Yeah? Because, uh, yes, because uh, the management here invited me very early on, uh, at the beginning of the pandemic, when there was just concrete slabs and, you know, nothing had come up really. So I've been following the project. I've been here three times with, with Fatmis to see the developments and uh, there was never a doubt in my mind that this will be a success because I know his his business history in Norway and also in Kosovo before so um, but you know I've been so excited to, to see this uh, coming up and uh, it's so elegant it's so fresh and I also know that behind the materials here there are highest European standards for environment, for safety, for, for, for fire and, and, uh, and water damages and so on. So I think this is one, probably one of the best uh, quality uh, malls in Europe at the moment. Yeah. We have met before, but uh, I either, and of course I, I hope you also, you didn't uh, uh, thought that uh, this would be this kind of show would be uh, the 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 TV uh, product that we could be together, right? Yes. No, no, no. I'm also very excited to see you again, and it's good to <laughs> good to have this a little bit relaxing talk, you know, and also about you know private sector investments because it's mm -hmm. extremely important mm -hmm. in in every country, but but certainly also in Kosovo for employment of the young and to to generate more income and, and production in in Kosovo. Mm -hmm. So do you see Kosovo? Kosovo is uh, attractive for the foreign investments? Uh, I, I, I certainly do. I've been working uh, in and for Kosovo for almost 13 years and uh, we have a lot of uh, experience with uh, the ICT sector in Kosovo mm -hmm. and, and young talents working on uh, digital economy, finding solutions. There are strong companies on this in Kosovo at the moment, but also in other parts of manufacturing the industry, like you have uh, for beverages, you have for beds, and you mm -hmm. have a lot of strong production centers uh, in Kosovo. And I think, you know, there's this ample room for, for, for developing that further. So um, I'm just hoping that um, uh, international integration and trade will, will uh, come up. And I can also tell you that right now, Norway, together with a few other countries, are uh, finalizing a new free trade agreement with Kosovo. It's called okay. the EFTA Free Trade Agreement, yes. Mm -hmm. And it will be finalized later this year. So, so step by step, I see these things going on. Yeah. yeah. Uh, as, I, as, I saw, as I saw in the, in the mall, which is uh, the biggest mall here in the, in, in the region, there are a few uh, Norwegian uh, companies here. In, in in Pristina Mall, uh, how do the Norwegian companies see uh, Kosovo? Do they see an opportunity? Are they present with the investments here, or uh, you think that uh, that is too soon? No, no, no. I, I think this is the right time, and I can tell you that we have uh, some three, four companies within renewable energy, which is uh, currently looking into investments in 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 Kosovo. And uh, we also have uh, retail companies, like you mentioned, and Change, which, uh, which uh, some of the management here has been bringing in here to, to Kosovo. So I think this will grow and grow and grow. And also we have, and this I think is very important, we have in Norway about uh, close to 20,000 people with uh, families in Kosovo and in Norway, mm -hmm. and they bring a lot of business activity both ways. Yeah. So I, I, see, uh, I see only a stronger future for this. The, the embassy will not be present from the from September, and, and that there was a news widespread here in the in in Kosovo. That was a, a bad news for the people that knows you, and of course they they recognize the Norwegian help. What what is going to be the the future of uh, the uh, uh, Norwegian diplomacy regarding?